What's up guys, it's Michael here. In this video, we're gonna talk about how you can own anything for free. And yes, I really meant it. You can actually buy something and actually own it for free. This even includes cars, any type of vehicle, even housing, anything super expensive, as long as you know how to make it work for you. So here's what you need to know. There are two things you gotta think about when you buy an item. First, as I said in my previous video, is it a liability or is it an asset? Meaning is, one, if it's a liability, it means you buy it, but it takes away your money. So instead of making money, it takes it away. And two, if it's an asset, so if it's an asset, you buy it. First, you put money out of your pocket, but it is used to potentially make you money. And here I what I mean by potentially, because it means you are taking a risk whether or not it'll make you money or not. So for example, you see a lot of people make videos on their items and stuff, maybe do reviews on a product, maybe even try to get sponsorships. In that way, it helps them alleviate the amount of income. So basically, for example, if you spend money on a camera, for example, so you buy a camera, for example, like the camera I'm shooting this video on, the Sony A7S III, plus you gotta get the lens. So you're looking at about almost a five to $6,000 you know, investment. And whatever becomes a liability or an asset is up to you to decide, meaning is what you do of it. So if you buy that type of equipment and you basically use it you know, just to have fun with it, fine. I mean, it's not really a big deal. It just, just wasn't there to make you money. But if you turn it around and you show it off to people by showing how to use, maybe they can show it off how this function works and that, maybe you can use it as a sponsorship, you can use it as a video shoot. It's basically to show people to market, to market that product or market another type of product using that as a capturing attention. If that is the case, it becomes an asset. So another good example, you see a lot of people consider vehicles. You can see a lot of vehicles itself is actually nothing more than a liability, but that's actually far from the truth. So if you buy a vehicle and you market it, you put it on place platforms like you know YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, anything that pays with ad revenue, maybe even on Patreon, you can even show out of people. You can maybe people show even people a type of sponsorships that can actually change the whole entire ordeal. And the best part is when you show it off as an ordeal, you can actually even include as a tax incentive, as a write-off. So when you buy a product specifically, besides breaking it down between either as a liability or an asset, if you own a business and you can subject and relate that item, your purchase as a business purchase, saying that this equipment that you buy or object you buy is related to your business, you can write it off. For example, the best example is an automobile. So you buy a vehicle and you claim it as used for a business. For example, you buy whatever, a Tesla, maybe exotic car, Lamborghini, Ferrari. You say you can adequate, you can explain to the IRS and you pay your taxes and tell it like, hey, I'm using this for my business. Then you can write off all the incentives, all the extra stuff you pay, you can write that off. That's basically money saved. And next, when you write off a business, you can use it as an advertisement and platform. If you do that instead, instead of becoming a liability, it becomes an asset, it makes you money. So anything you buy, as long as you can figure out a way to make it into an asset, you can always own it for free. And what makes it really unique is the ability to write it off as a business. There's a lot of tax incentives out there. It's just that a lot of people don't know about, they have to take advantage of it. Just do some research, maybe watch YouTube videos like mine, and also click the subscribe button and like button down below. I can make more of this content, explain more in detail how you can turn things such as, you know, even a TV, even owning a house. Instead of, you know, losing money, you can actually make money. You can turn whatever you want into something more profitable. So how it basically works, if you own a business, you have to have a lot of leverage on your table. Meaning is anything you buy, anything you own, you can actually put it as a business expense. If you can explain to the IRS or any of tax incentives or tax collectors how does it relate to your business, you can write it off. And, and yes, you still have to pay money out your pocket, but you pay a lot less money out your pocket. Some of them is a lot, some of them is very little. At the same time, it gives you more leverage to turn into an asset as you can use that type of material you bought to use for your business and show it off to other people and maybe provide advertisers and other sponsorships saying like, hey, I got this product, I can shoot your product and make your product more valuable so more people come purchase your stuff. If that's the case, that is how you can make it more profitable as an asset. So if you wanna see more videos like this, please click the subscribe button down below and the like button. Make sure to comment, because when I see your comments, 
I can think of other topics and help explain to you what other methods you can do, including businesses, and what you can do to make more money to make your life more comfortable, making your life to live the way you want to be. Instead of buying the things that take away your money, why don't you buy things and convert it to help you make money? I'll see you guys next time on my channel. Peace and hit the subscribe button.